Hello and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4 for another online challenge uh, with Fail Games. This time looking at rally cars. Um, so going back to that Group B era of these super fast, super crazy machines, um, we thought we'd put the Audi Quattro up against the Lancia O37 um, over on Fortune Island, um, which is the there's so many dirt tracks and stuff over there, it's the obvious place to test rally cars. Um, so we thought we'd take them over there um, for some rally races, off-road races, see how they compared. Obviously, um, upgrading them so they're about the same level, but keeping the stock drivetrain and stuff. So this still had a massive advantage in Forza, because of course it's all-wheel drive, which is super OP in Forza, basically. Um, so the Audi did have that as an advantage here going into this challenge but otherwise yeah it was interesting to see how the two cars compared here on the game anyway this is what happened when we put them head to head in a series of races right which would you have I would have the Audi, it's quite a close one though, I do really like both of them. Okay, I'll have the Lancia. Just because I think it looks better. Whoa, why is this suddenly faster than yours? I'm not sure. Here we go! Oh, it's too tempting to just pull the handbrake and go around the corner sideways. Yeah. Mine just sort of goes sideways anyway, simply because it's rear-wheel drive. This is, you need a better driver than me to get the most out of this car. He has left us. Oh, I visited a wall. Here we go. Goodbye. And past he goes. This thing is really fast. I hit a tree. And missed the checkpoint. So all of that was for nothing. Well that was a spectacular few corners of sliding. Wasn't very fast, but it looked good. This track would be really good fun for the drive truck community race, but I don't think many people have <laughs> the expansion. No, that's the trouble with using the expansions. when you only get six or seven people anyway. Oh no. I somehow saved it off, oh, fun as well, except in the other direction. <laughs> and an all-wheel drive car, I'm really good at the sort of at the thin stretch before uh, in the north northwest. However, in a real-wheel drive car, I'm not so sure. I'm not terribly familiar with this track. Well, I mean, we learned that last time, but because I haven't, yes. I've only driven it like three times. Twice. I think I've only won it twice, or once. I've missed another checkpoint. Just I've because spun. This but I... drive. <laughs> if I had checkpoints in the WRC, this car would not have won. Okay, that was effectively a reverse entry drift. That probably wasn't quite necessary. I'm 
sort of not sticking to the road. Oh. I've unintentionally left the road. I spun. This car is very tail happy. That's a lot of fence I've just knocked over. I don't make rally cars like this anymore. No, I'd watch a lot more rally if they did. Yeah, people might actually buy WRC Plus. I went very wide. No, don't what go over the done? cliff. I attempted to take that corner at very high speed by pulling the handbrake. Yeah, I would have done that if you hadn't gone over. So that's actually quite a good thing that you went over for me. I was approaching it at about 150 and I decided to just pull the handbrake and hope for the best. Well, I don't I'd know if there are any corners you can cut in this sort of race. I don't think it's like the race we did on Saturday where you give out was a massive corner. Yeah, not to that extent, I don't think. If I stop messing about and pulling the handbrake, I might actually catch up. I'm pulling the handbrake constantly and I've spun so many times it's amazing you are yes. run by miles. I've spun quite a lot as well. Okay, this stretch you ha I pull the handbrake just because it looks awesome. Whoa! 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 I almost oh. followed you. That fence nearly pulled me off. I'm stumbling down the hill. I'd love to be in your club on this stretch. It is pretty nice to drive along here, apart from that fence that I hit. That section was not However, good. However, this car I do not want to be here for long, so I'm just going to floor it and see uh, how quickly I can get out of here. Oh, I'm heading towards those rocks. That was pretty much the back tyre hanging off the edge of the cliff. I could have done that in an all-wheel drive car, I promise. <laughs> wow, I keep hitting the cliff face. This is not very spectacular from my end. And back onto the tarmac. Is that only how far you've got so far? Oh, there isn't a long straight anymore. Stop trying to pull the handbrake. Why do I keep the doing that? turning circle on this is terrible. Keep pulling the handbrake. I can actually see you. <laughs> Nearly there. Out of the tight corners, I can actually get some speed down here. Come on! I've spun! A little wall tap around the final corner. 1 0 for the quattro.
the interesting shape. <laughs> Oh, this is this circuit. This circuit's a pain in the backside when you do this for the actual progress. For, 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 for progression. Oh! Oh, really? I appear to be the more accomplished wall rider. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> what did you do? Missed a checkpoint. checkpoint. I thought I'd missed it and it didn't come up, and I thought I'd got past it. <laughs> Whoa, that bump threw me into a wall. Oh no, this is the second lap. Right. That went... Well... I hit that wall last time. This car is too fast. It's scary how fast this thing is. Yeah, mine's similar. Oh. How did it? What was it? Wait, what? You know those smooth walls? Yeah, I, I did that How's in that the. Not smooth? I did that in one of the drive tribe races on Saturday. I just clipped the end of a wall and it did that. Oh. I have no idea why. Right, this is the bit that matters. Why are you sliding so much? I don't actually know. I'm not even trying to at this point. <laughs> I'm sliding because I'm in all the in rear wheel drive and I lost control at some point and I'm still trying to Whoa. regain control. So I haven't actually regained control. The car's just sort of taking me. <laughs> That was almost an accident across the finish line, but... <laughs> right, that's 2-0 for the Quattro. I'm assuming because of Ford's uh, all-wheel drive bias. May have bad fortune. Bad <laughs> My purple petrol has joined the session. What? You said purple petrol 13 has joined the session. <laughs> Okay. Did you know that you were part of the session? No, I don't know what I'm doing here. Ah! Oh. <laughs> that was amazing how we didn't hit each other. I know, I didn't even have enough time to turn. I did my usual and drove just like an all-wheel drive car. That's why it's fun. I keep hitting these walls and missing these checkpoints. That was not a drift tap, that was a crash. Yeah, it, when you do an actual drift tap, it gives you a crunch.
I do believe that is this is going to be a 3-0 for the Quattro. Yeah, it's looking that way. Unless I miss a checkpoint or something. Oh, I've spun. Oh, and I'm on my way. Oh, there's a bunch of deer on the track. <laughs> there's loads of them back there. Just running around this. in circles doing donuts. <laughs> I don't know why there's quite so many of them. Right, 3-0 on the Quattro. So there we go, that's what happened with the, the Quattro up against the O37 there. Um, the Quattro taking it by quite a margin. Um, but like I say, in Forza there is a huge bias towards all-wheel drive cars, so it did have the advantage there. It was so much more controllable uh, and easy to drive um, than, than the Lancia was. You can, you can see that from the races. The Lancia was quite difficult to keep under control. The rear-wheel drive... Um, Obviously the back swinging out a lot on the dirt and gravel, um, whereas the Audi had much more control, which I guess is why all-wheel drive became favoured uh, in rally, but yeah, it did. It is particularly noticeable on Forza, the difference, so that did kind of give it an unfair advantage. Um, but there we go, the, the Quattro came out on top in that one. And yeah, do make sure to go and check out Fail Games channel um, to see the Lancia, the Lancia's perspective of this video, as well as plenty other Forza and other gaming content. Um, I'm sure you'll find some stuff you like over there if you enjoy the videos here. Um, so make sure to go and have a look over there. Um, but otherwise, do suggest any challenges or cars you'd like to see put up against each other uh, in the comments, and we'll see if we can make some videos on those um, otherwise thank you very much for watching uh, i hope you enjoy it and i'll be back with the next video very soon